Welcome to CirclePad Video Help for Menus. To get started, we're going to show you how to create a simple menu. So in CirclePad, that's really easy. You just go under Page, click on Menus, and pick whichever menu type you want. So then you select the menu and it opens this dialog box here. And then you can basically change the buttons at the top of your menu. So, so if instead of Photos, we wanted something that said uh, Membership and then we wanted to delete about us and then we're gonna you can also drag and drop these things to reorder them and then we can click here and add one more button for um, let's call it travel and then I click finish and then this makes the menu now the next stage is how to edit your menu so if we want to edit this menu we can just click on it and the first way you can edit is you can drag this box around. You can drag the left side or the right side. You can click on it and move its location by clicking and dragging it around. And then you can also click on here and click on um, font, for example. You can make it bigger. Uh, you can make it italic if you wanted. You can change the font to something different. Then we can go in and change the color. So the main color is the color of all your pages that uh, you're linking to. And the highlight color is whatever page you're currently on. So if this is your home page, then it's the highlight color. So the next thing that we want to do is to look how to make pages from our menu. So we haven't saved this page yet, and we don't have a Contact Us page, we don't have a travel page or a membership page. We just want all that stuff made automatically for us. So you just click on the menu, you click Edit, and then you click on this box here that says make page, create pages. And it basically goes and tells you it started to created this page, it created the travel page, and it's done. And we click finish, and if we hit save here, you'll see the page is named home because the menu was changed home. And if I open up one of my other pages, say I open up the membership page, you can see it highlighted membership on that page. So if I put uh, I can go put uh, whatever graphics, say I put a bunch of graphics on this page and some photos. Um, I'll just put a, uh, say it's a, a fruit company. Okay, so then I can save this. So that made all our different pages and set our menu up and that was very simple. So the next thing is how do you create links on these menus. So let's say we wanted to have uh, another change on here. Let's edit our menu and we're going to add another button on here and we're going to call that button uh, Google and we're going to do a link to uh, google.com so we could we could link to Google we could pick a page here uh, we can set up whatever kind of link that we want and then we hit finish and you can see that's been updated onto our onto our uh, menu now if we save this we're on our membership page this change that we made is not on all our other pages but the menu makes that easy we just click edit and hit create pages it'll tell us oh you already made these pages do you want your new menu to copy over there and you just click OK and it clock gives the new menu over to anything so if we go open our home page now there we go our home page has the Google link on it so finally, uh, the last thing to look at is how to attach graphics. When you build a menu, you usually don't just want it to be this bar. You want it to be, let's say we want to have a box. So we'll get a rectangle and we'll move it underneath. We'll put it here. And uh, you probably also want some images. So I'll just change the color of this to, let's say we're going to make that very light and we're going to put a little, uh, I guess probably we would put a title up here edit our, our site and we'll put a graphic as well for coffee so if we want to have this little uh, coffee photo and we want to have the text and this bar part of our menu all we have to do is attach them. The same way when you use email, you use attachments. Just click on this object, click edit, and you can attach it to the menu. 
and then click on here, and then click Edit, and click Attach to Menu, and there, Edit, and at the bottom here, Attach to Menu. So now if we go click on our menu and we edit it, it'll tell us, oh, we have three attachments on our menu, and we can get rid of them if we want. So now it's a simple matter of just to create our pages again, unless all of our pages already exist, and then it copied this menu over to all our other pages. So if we go look and we open, say, our uh, membership page, you can see there it is, there's the membership, there's all the graphics that we put on it, and all the little details have copied across. So in under a minute or two, you can create a complete website and you can change it however you want.